Uh, the chief of staff actually uh, spoke to a number of staff this morning, uh, reassuring them that there were uh, personnel changes, uh, no immediate personnel changes at this time, uh, and that people shouldn't be concerned. We should do exactly uh, what we do every day, and that's come to work and do the very best job that we can, and that's exactly what we're doing. That's exactly what we're focused on, and many of us have relayed that to other staffers that weren't part of that meeting, and we're going to continue to focus uh, on having record success in this second year as we had in our first year and we fully expect to do that and we expect that to do that as a staff and as a team. I again like I said last night and I'll echo it again I spoke directly to the president last night uh, he asked me to, to pass that message along to General McMaster I know the two of them have been in meetings today uh, whether or not that came up I don't know but again our focus is not on uh, a lot of the news stories that you guys would like us to be uh, focused on but we're actually focused on what the American people want us to do and that's to come here and do our jobs. General McMaster uh, is a dedicated public servant, and he is here not focused on the news stories that many of you are writing, but on some really big issues, things like North Korea, things like Russia, things like Iran. That's what he's doing, and that's what we're going to continue to be focused on every Mr. single day that we show up for work. The president shouldn't be bound because Democrats in, in the Senate can't do their job. If the president wants to be able to make a change because he feels like it's the right thing for the American people, his hand shouldn't be tied because Democrats Democrats failed to do what they were elected to do. This president was elected to put forward policies and push those policies forward with the team that he selects, not the team that the Democrats think he should have. That's not how the system works. And just because they don't want the president to have his full team, that doesn't mean if he decided to make changes, he shouldn't be able to.